Adult survivors of child sexual abuse gathered in this room this day to listen to a news conference by the United Nations Human Rights Council team. The former J-pop talents have spoken up about how they became victims of late Johnny Kitagawa, who is also the founder of Japan's leading talent agency, Johnny and Associates. The men were teenagers when they were sexually abused by Kitagawa around 40 years ago. Kitagawa was already in his 40s. They were not the only victims. The United Nations experts said that it was deeply concerned following allegations of hundreds of sexual abuse cases by the media mogul. The team, which was visiting Japan to investigate the state of human rights in Japanese workplaces, also pointed out that it received reports that the Japanese media had buried the scandals. It called on the country's government to take the initiative in ensuring effective relief for the victims.